Bolt Energy Polaris Ranger install. So my name is Jake Bianchi uh, and I operate Best Battery out of Wildwood, Florida. And we do golf cart batteries. Bolt Energy highly recommends having a trained golf car or battery technician perform all battery maintenance on your vehicle. Bolt also highly recommends using personal protective equipment during the battery installation. In addition to this tool list, you may also need small gauge wiring supplies. And we'll start by removing the old solenoid, disconnecting your contactor cables. Then we will install the Bolt Energy 48 volt, 400 amp continuous, 600 amp burst solenoid. We will then have to cut off these ends and crimp on ring terminals so we can bolt them down to the new solenoid. We will now install our two gauge cables to our new solenoid. You will now install your new cable and you will have to make a new cable end or open up your cable end to go to your controller. This connector, you will have to make all your cable ends go to positive through this jumper. And connect these right to the solenoid, battery side positive. We will now uninstall the charger. And then remount our Bolt Energy charger in the same location. Showing the charger interlock connections. You will have to put your charger interlock on the second brown wire in. And then clean up the other excess wires and seal them with heat shrink. You will then mount your AC port. Cut a hole for the state of charge meter using a 2 and 1 16 inch hole saw. Pull the meter harness through the hole and connect it to the state of charge meter. Insert the meter and secure it to the dash panel with the bracket and wing nut provided. Do not push the center of the state of charge meter when pressing it into the dash. You will now measure out and mount your brackets down.
you can now mount down your hardware to hold the battery in place. Once the battery is installed, you can finish routing your wires and clean up everything underneath. Then we will mount our bolt energy voltage reducer. The yellow wire, that'll be your battery positive. The black will be your battery negative. The green wire is going to be your 48 volt ignition source. The red wire is your 12 volt output ignition source. And your blue is your constant 12 volt output. This would be for your radio memory or any other accessories that you need to keep on, like a volt, maybe a GPS. In this application, we will power the voltage reducer on at all times by connecting our green wire and our yellow wire to the positive. Now we'll mount in our second battery. Attaching your positive to positive in parallel and then your negative to negative in parallel. You will be running power off of one battery and negative off the other. Now test. We will now install the Bluetooth module. And we always recommend ABC, always be charging. While you're waiting for your Bolt Energy battery to max charge, go ahead and download the Bolt Energy USA mobile application on the Android or iOS app stores. Open the application and select your battery. 
The application will connect to the battery via a Bluetooth connection and display the battery's information in real time. If you scroll down, you can check the battery's internal health. And if you scroll down further, you will see the two most important features of the mobile app that you will probably never need to use. The update firmware feature allows existing Bolt Energy battery owners to remotely update their battery's firmware should a new firmware release. The Send Data feature allows a Bolt Energy technician to remotely diagnose your battery in the extremely rare event of a warranty claim. Simply select Send Data. Your battery's data log will be displayed. Click the Mail icon. Select Email and email to support at boltenergyusa.com. A Bolt technician will receive your data log, diagnose, and immediately begin the warranty process should your battery need replacement. This feature makes the warranty process simple and efficient. As always, hit the like and subscribe buttons. We have more installation and product videos coming out on a regular basis, so we hope to see you next time.